anything that is too dear to you your heart is there talk to me you have been spending and been saving you have been working your salary your income your investment towards one and even when you are sleeping you'll be dreaming it he said for where your treasure is there will your heart be also you know most times we don't understand it and we use this parable but when i meditate on this word the lord put it strongly to me if you look at verse 33 there is still a statement they're talking about putting treasure in heaven what does he say he says say that you have and give arms that will answer i talk about giving to the work of god giving to the poor helping to the people you are better than doing good work he said provide yourself bags which works not old a treasure in the heaven that faileth not be a notive approach it neither mud corrupt our giving is not to attract popularity we are not giving because we want to win election one day or want the society to know us the purpose is that we are building a treasure in heaven we are conscious of heaven we will believe that one day we'll get to heaven and whatever we are sowing we are going to reap it one day and that's why we are preparing it and if this had been our mindset and we if, can even go to the estate denying ourselves comfort selling some good things to build for the kingdom i tell you come me seven because i will say where you have made your investment there your heart will be and it came to pass that the beggar died and was carried by the angel into who have you ever asked yourself why is he called abraham's bosom talk to me it was not called he didn't call it god's bosom that's to say abraham built that bosom while he was alive i want to give you assignment as a pastor as a leader here you hearing me go and make a research on your bible how many servants did abraham have in his own time he fed them he clothed them he sponsored their children to school there were some servants they were man and woman that had children they were under abraham being feeding everything about them lie on him and yet he don't have a child and was taking care of them ah he didn't know he was building a treasure he did not just get to men. He get to prophet who were making seller. God himself. He get to Trinity. Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Genesis 18. These are treasure. So when you are sowing your seed, you do. Now there are different. Some are given because people you want people to know that I know how to give. That's rubbish. When you came with the heart knowing that this is my part of worship. You are not giving to people to be recognized. You are giving to people because you are preparing a treasure. It's a part of my worship. I tell you, you are preparing something spiritual. Even though God did not carry that money physically, but the value is counted in heaven. That's why Jesus said, if your money can go towards the kingdom, your attitude toward the kingdom, your sacrifice, purification toward the kingdom, your heart will be there because you have treasure there. It, that treasure there is an investment. It's your lifetime. You know, people say, save for retirement. This one not be earthly retirement. This one a spiritual retirement. You on earth, are you sure you have prepared your home? There are many that are rich here when they cross over, they are poor. They have nothing to show up. 